Hello YouTube, in today's video I'm going to be recording my process recessing the grip screws so that they sit flush or a little bit below the surface of the grip and at the same time I'm going to be trying to uh, index the screws so that they, um, the slots in them are facing the exact same direction parallel to each other basically. I'm going to try to show you that currently these screws protrude out of the grip even though not by a lot but they still protrude and you can see that so what I want to do is cut back the underside of the heads of each screw so they sit flush with the grip Here's what I'll be using. I'll be using my uh, power drill and a small triangular file <coughs> with one uh, flat side. The flat side will be facing the, uh, the threads so that they, I don't ruin the threads. And one of the sides I'm going to be using to cut, uh, cut back the underside of the head. So we're going to chuck up the screw very gently. What I don't want to do is ruin the threads, so I'm going to chuck it up like that. Again, I'll position the file with the flat side towards the towards the chuck and threads. Here's that cleaned up screw, there. Here's how the underside looks. All right, now I'm gonna install it. Now here's that screw. And I think I've tightened it about the same amount uh, as I did before so yeah it's nice and tight so now let's see if it sticks out any maybe just a little bit more you can see it barely above the grip and I still feel it slightly so maybe a little more it needs to be removed plus <clears throat> I want to turn it like I said so that the slot is this way parallel to the slide so that's how I want it turned so that helps I'm gonna remove a little bit more material it'll turn a little bit further in and uh, hopefully we can get it to line up with the slide Now let's try again that same screw again I'll show you that the threads don't seem to be affected all that much <clears throat> I'll show you the underside so now let's get that screw in there sorry I'm gonna try to move out of the light Now let's torque this down a bit. So you see I still have a little bit to go uh, before it lines up with the slide. So I figure I'd rest the screw next to the hole so it's all same zoom. 
or same focus. You can see that the screw looks pretty decent on the underside. What I'm going to do now is put it into my screwdriver because it's magnetic and we're going to line it up there and start turning it in so there it got tight you can see it's turning the gun and now I'm going to snug it up really well Okay, this is super tight, it's almost lining up, just a little more left. Alright, I made another pass, and we'll see. Turning the gun. Here you go. Oh, maybe a little bit more. I think I can turn it a little bit more. Now this one is lined up, lined up and now I'm going to need to start working on that. On the bottom one but before I do that let me show you that the screw is recessed you see that it's not sticking out of the grip anymore oh. don't focus on that see that now when I move over it I don't even know that a screw is there. It kind of feels the same. So here's another screw. Sorry about the music in the background. My wife is listening to some music. All right, now you can see that both screws are aligned, uh, as in their parallel slots, screw slots are parallel to the slide, and uh, they're both recessed into the grip, so I can't feel them going over the, uh, the grip surface. I can't feel the screws protruding at all. On this side, it's done. Now I'm going to proceed to the other side.